rejoice and be glad about it. We enter his gates with thanksgiving. Have we enter his courts with praise? Yeah. Anybody come to praise him today? Yeah. I heard that y'all already saw that my song. God sent his son. They called him Jesus. He came to love. the way. 
way, nailing it to the cross. Oh, in whom we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sin according to the riches of his grace. Amen. Aren't you glad? Yeah. It was one cross, three nails, and we are forgiven. Amen. Come on, give the Lord a hand. All right.
changed it so that we can one day wear a crown. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh Lord, one day. I'll cherish the old rugged cross. Well, he carried the things he carried. Oh, last week I talked about the things that he carried. Yeah. He carried our sorrows for uh -huh, me. Uh -huh. He carried our grief for me. Yeah. He carried our pain for me. Yeah. He carried, he was wounded for our transgressions, yeah. bruised for our need. Yeah. Yeah. The chastisement of our peace, uh -huh. the punishment yeah. that belongs to us yeah. was upon him. And with his strife. Oh, we can't declare today that we are healed. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Sometimes when you're sick in your body, you ain't always got to go to the doctor. You ain't got to always go to Princeton or Booth. You got to call on Dr. Jesus. Because he said he was wounded for you. Hallelujah. Yes. He was bruised for you. The pain that he took supposed to be now. He went and I stay in. Jesus paid it all. Right now. Oh. No charge. Yeah. My shame. Yeah. He said, no charge. Oh, our spiritual death. Our physical death. Pain. He said, no charge. Yeah. Rejection. Yeah. He carried all that last week. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. To the cross for us. Yeah. Loneliness. Yeah. Father, why have thou forsaken me? Uh -huh. Will you take this bitter cup from me? But nevertheless, Father. It's not my will, but let your will be done. No charge. He paid it all for us, y'all. We have a bill. He dropped the charges. Aren't you glad today that he rose? He rose not with some power, but he rose with all power. Hallelujah. Aren't you glad today that he went to the cross for you? For you. For me. But he got up.
the flood. Hallelujah. Anybody glad for the flood today? The blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. We thank God today for this is Resurrection Sunday. God is not dead. He's alive. Hallelujah. We're going to yield now for our greatest ministry to come. Praise God. Amen. Amen. Amen.
celebration, Elder Geraldine Taylor and the Spiritual Shepherd, Five Silver Queen. Today, <coughs> March 31st at 4 p.m., they're asking for a donation of $15. That's today at 4 p.m. Mount Sinai Missionary Baptist Church, Reverend Angelo Hines Sr. is the pastor, called out and sent to preach the gospel, Romans 10, 15. The pastor will be Timothy Simmons, guest minister of the Vision Church, Bessemer, Alabama, and this ordination will happen on April 7, 2024 at 3 p.m. Um, happy birthday and anniversary to everyone celebrating this upcoming week and the thought for the week. Forgive everyone, no matter what, but always remember the lesson you learned with them. Lord God. And I stand on your promises. 
this, Lord God. Lord God, the word says that he was bruised for our transgression. Oh, Lord. Wounded for our transgression. Bruised for our iniquities, Lord God. And the chastisement of our peace was upon him, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Lord God, knowing that he got up in all power, Lord God, it's nothing, Lord God, that I cannot, that God cannot do, Lord God. Oh, glory, hallelujah, Lord God. We don't have to worry about nothing because the price has already been paid, Lord God. He paid it in full, Lord God. It said one cross, three nails. We are forgiven, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God, for being a forgiving God. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, God, for being a delivering God. Oh, glory. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Hallelujah, Lord God. Yeah. Hallelujah, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God, for being a way maker, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God. We can't see our way, Lord God. You've already made the way, Lord God. Lord God, we, we, we learned in Sunday school when the, when, they went, when the women went to the tomb and, and they were trying to figure out who was going to roll the stone away. It had already been taken care of. That's how God is with us. He already take care of things for us. Oh, 
that don't know you, don't have a relationship, don't spend no time with you, Lord God. We pray for them right now, Lord God. Lord, open their hearts and their minds, oh Father God, and let them remind, remind them, Lord God, that it's more than an egg day, Lord God, in the name of Jesus. This is a resurrection day, Lord God. Oh, glory, Lord hallelujah. Lord God, Lord God. Glory, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord God. Amen. And because you were resurrected, Lord yeah, God, yeah. we can be too, Lord God. Thank, Thank you. Lord. We can be reconciled back to you, Lord God. Thank In the name of Jesus, Lord God. Yeah. Lord, give us a repentant spirit, Lord yeah. God, so that we may come, Lord God. Lord God, ask yeah, to be forgiven way. and yeah. repent of all our sins, oh Father God. In the name In the of name Jesus, oh Father God. And now, Lord God, and I come, now. Lord God, asking you to bless the offering, Lord God. In bless our tithes and offerings, Lord God. Bless all those, Lord God, that gave, Lord God. Bless those that had a heart to give and weren't able to give, oh Father God. In the name of Jesus, oh Father God. Father God, we thank you, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God. For people, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God. Oh, bless you right now, Lord. Bless right now, Lord God. And then, Lord God, we ask you to bless our pastor, Lord God. Bless as he break the bread have on this morning, have Lord mercy. God. Oh, Lord, as he pour out into us, Lord God, what God has already poured into him, have Lord mercy, God. Open your hearts and your minds and receive, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Lord, we come thanking you, Lord God. We thank you for your word, Father God, in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Lord God, that, that word that will break all chains, oh, Father God, whatever this has us bind up, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, Lord God, you are a chain breaker, Lord God, in the name Glory of Jesus. To your name. Lord God, we thank you. We love you. And we, we magnify you. you. And we glorify you, Lord God, in, in Jesus, Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. And the church says, Amen. 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 Amen.
Sí. have to do it because scripture had said he had to do it Isaiah said he would be wounded for our transgressions Isaiah said he would be bruised for our iniquities. Isaiah said the chastisement of our peace would be upon him. Isaiah said with his strength cancer would be cured with his stripes diabetes would be cured with his stripes all manner of illness would be with his stripes we would be healed he had to do it When on the cross of Calvary, the Lord was crucified. The mob stood round about him and mocked until to share the agony, but one of them cried out to him, oh Lord, remember me, oh what a shame to kill him. Hey! 
God some praise in his house. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Now I know. Thank you, Lord. I know. I'm looking at some folk who did not get Powerball. Amen. I'm looking at some folk that I don't believe got the mega millions on Friday. Amen. But I am looking at some folk, amen, who glad Alabama won. They basketball game. Come, give God some praise, amen, for the good things that he has done. Bless his holy name. Bless his holy name. We have come into this house and gathered in his name to worship him. That's right. Amen. That's right. I'm yet praying that God would deliver me from folk who don't want to give him what he deserves. Hello, somebody. All right, all right. I, I, I need to preach today. But some of y'all ain't ready for this. Some of y'all still caught up in something. And I'm trying to discern what it is so that I can 
declare and decree that you are free. Hello, somebody. If it was somebody that angered you, upset you, amen, got on your legs, sanctified nerd, amen, shake your head, amen, and get them out. Glory to God. Hello, somebody. If the boss man, amen, made your good Friday a bad Friday, amen, shake, shake, shake it out of your head and just get rid of it. If you are upset because your age has exempted you from the Easter egg hunt later, amen, Gloria, shake it out of your head, amen, and get rid of it. A a age gonna do that, amen. It's gonna exempt you from a lot of stuff. Wow. Oh, glory to God, amen. In, in fact, I'm glad age has exempted some of us. Because some of us needed to be exempted. But we need an anointing right now. And if your week was anything like mine, just lift your hands and, and call for an anointing. If you struggle, amen. If you press your way, amen. And some of the goodness that you started out with, amen, went by the wayside. Just say, anointing. Follow me. Say it like you really mean it. Follow me. Let the power. The Holy Ghost. Anointing. Anointing fall on me. Anointing. Come on, Eddie. Come on, Eddie. I need some help today. Anointing. Let the power of the Holy Ghost fall. Anointing. Lord God, keep hold on. We need your anointing right now. Some yokes need to be broke. Some people right now need to be set free. Some burdens need to be lifted right now. And we know that you can if only you will. Don't know how, but we know you can. And we declare and claim it right now in the house of Antioch that right now, your Holy Ghost will descend upon this sanctuary. And whatever is yet troubling your people, you who are omnipotent, all powerful, you who are omniscient, all-knowing. Yeah. You who are omnipresent everywhere at the same time. Open the windows of heaven. Not that we're any better than anybody else. But I declare that this is a Holy Ghost filling station. And somebody's Tesla needs a charge right now. Infuse, indwell, and have your way. 
anoint this place. This day. In the name of Jesus. He who was dead. But the old country bumpkin said, he ain't dead no more. He's alive. And we celebrate his getting up right now. So we say hallelujah. 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 Glory. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord God. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord God. And the people of God said amen. Take out your weapons of destruction, of evil. That is your Bible. Yeah. Even if it's electronic, uh -huh. make sure that's the app that you have open right now. Close all them other ones. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. Tick-tock later. <laughs> now hold on high so the enemy can see that you ain't playing. This is my Bible. God's holy word. A lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. It is basic instruction. Look at your neighbor. Smile at him. It is, it is. Basic, instruction, basic instruction, but only the believers, believers before leaving earth. Before leaving earth. Amen. 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 Now that person that you just said that to, do they look like a believer? Glory to God. Glory to God. Amen. Amen. Looks can fool you. <laughs> Amen, Dietrich. <laughs> Amen. Some of us are glad right now, Tay, that we don't look like what we've been through. Oh, Lord. Huh? Oh, Lord. Huh? Emma, not only am I glad I don't look like what I've been through, I'm glad I don't smell like what I've been through. Uh, I'm trying. I'm, I'm trying to reach somebody today. Amen, Lord. Because I ain't always walk. I just I didn't walk through some petunias this week. Amen. I didn't walk through some rose gods. Amen. I walked through some stuff. Amen. 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 And, and, and if if you ever was walking and not looking where you was walking. Amen. And you accidentally, amen, step in some stuff. Amen. Amen. It followed you, didn't it? Didn't it? Well, I stepped in some stuff this week and it followed me, glory to God. I had to get through some more shoes. Glory to God. Hello, somebody. Amen. It, 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 wasn't, it wasn't physical stuff. Amen. It was spiritual stuff. So the older amen was a little bit stronger. So, so, so I, I, I had to get me some new shoes just to get up in here today. Hello, somebody. Keep on living and claiming that you're a Christian. Y'all going to step in some stuff, too. Hello, hello. 
Jesus stepped in a whole lot of stuff just for you. Hello, hello. We were dirty. We were stinking. Hello. But he cleaned us up. His blood washed us. And now, can, can, can I do it the way it really needs to be done, Raphael? Some of us, some of us are whiter than snow. Now, I, I don't know who you are, amen, but I, I'll just say, I'm just telling the truth today. Some of us, JC, have been washed. Some of us just been rinsed. <laughs> hello, hello. Glory to God. A -a -a amen, amen. But I pray today by the end of our service, amen, you can get the rest of what you need. Yes, hello. You can completely be washed by the word of our God. Amen. Turn with me, turn with me, amen, to the gospel as recorded by, amen, that tax collector. Yes. St. Matthew. Yeah. Amen, amen, amen. Do I need to come get you? Or are you going to wake up? Sit up. Don't, don't make me call. Come on, sit up. A -a -a amen, amen. They mine. Hello, A -a amen, amen. I, I, I will check them. Amen. That, 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 that's, a, that's the problem, amen. That's one of the problems, amen, with, with some of our households, amen, is that we are not checking our children the way they ought to be checked. Hello. Our children are checking us. Do you want to go to church today? God knows I wish I had a had that option. <laughs> but I knew what to say, amen. Even when, come on, Jimmy, amen. Do you want to? <laughs> no, no, I'm already getting up going. Glory to God, amen. Uh, I'm getting up going because I need to go to the Lincoln that Sunday night. <laughs> Hello, somebody, amen. And if I, if I didn't go to church on Sunday school, amen, I, I couldn't go to the Lincoln Davis, amen. Glory to God, amen. And one of them Sundays, amen, James Brown was on the screen. So I got to church early. And I wrote down everything they said. That was a Sunday, amen, that they threw that cape on him. And <laughs> Ow! <laughs> No, they were trying to get him not to go. <laughs> Bless his holy name. Bless his holy name. Amen. St. Matthew, amen, chapter 26. Yes, sir. Just one verse, just one verse. Verse 30. When you found it, amen, stand for the reverence and reading of God's holy word. And the word of God reads from the King James translation. And when they had sung and him, they went out into the Mount of Olives. Amen. The grass withers, the flower faded, but the word of God, amen, shall stand forever. Praise his holy name. And when they, uh -huh. Jesus and the 11 yes, sir. disciples, had sung a hymn, they, 
went out into the Mount of Olives. Yes, For a little while, I want to press upon you from this subject. The Easter hymn that changed the world. The Easter hymn that changed the world. Look at your neighbor and say, it, it, it wasn't that old rugged cross hymn. No, sir. No, sir. It wasn't he lives. No, come on, come on. Tell him, it, it, it wasn't he rose. But there was an Easter hymn that changed the world. Oh, glory to God. Perhaps some of you have heard that music is an expression of the soul. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. anybody, anybody heard that? Yes, sir. Hello, hello, amen, amen. And some would argue, amen, that much of what comes out of the mouths of today's musicians, amen, would hardly, amen, support that theory. Show up, show up. Have you been listening to the radio or yes, sir. whatever it is, amen, amen. Yes. E e e even rap. Ain't what it used to be. Am I in the house today? Yes, Even hip hop, amen, that hopped over the hill. Up. <laughs> uh, music used to move folk. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Right. You, 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 you got folk like. Jimmy Grace and Errol Pap Johnson and uh, that crooner Deacon Williams and come around, Kenny, so I can see your face. A amen. Kennedy and JC, amen, who, who would stand on a corner under the street lights and they would croon. Yeah. Hello, somebody. And females would come to the window and cheer them on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, somebody. Hello. Uh, but much of the music that we have grown accustomed to singing, amen, in this celebration of Resurrection Day, amen, can certainly be described as an expression of the soul. All right. All right. Hymns like, Christ the Lord is risen yeah. today. today. All right. Hallelujah. Yes, or... Oh, I know that my Redeemer lives, yes, sir. and he lives yes, in me. Yes, but anyhow, sadly, the hymns of the church, amen, are disappearing yes. along with the hymn book. Yes, sir. Can I get a witness? Yes, sir. Yes. Worship music today, amen, is more apt to be a studio recreation. Yes, sir. And watch out, watch, watch, watch out, amen. And they got this new stuff out now called uh, AI. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Right. It, it, it can make something out of nothing. Yeah. Hello, somebody. My, my, Glory my, to God. My, my, my. Hymns are slowly becoming extinct. Right. Amen. amen. As we move towards the 21st century, amen, with new and contemporary Christian music, amen, and, and don't get me wrong, don't get me wrong, most of it's all good, amen. glory to God, I, I don't have a problem, amen, glory to God, with, with Kurt Franklin, amen, telling us to stomp, yeah. as long as we stomp in the right way, right. hello somebody, glory to God, uh, but it seems like sometimes we're throwing the baby out with the bath water. Bless his holy name. But the good news is that some hymns transcend and go beyond time. Yeah. Amen. In fact, in fact, hymns like the one that Jesus sang with his 11 disciples during the Passover and stuff, amen, are still being sung and can be found in the book of Psalms. Yeah. Amen. Right. Psalms, which is the song book of faith. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And the song book of the faithful. Hello, somebody. 
at the last Passover, Jesus and his disciples sung a series of hymns known as the Hallel. Glory to God, amen. In the Jewish tradition, amen, there were a well-established and various melodies for the singing of the Hallel, amen. And they're still being sung today by those of the Jewish faith. Some of the songs, amen, others, amen, are sung out loud. Right. Glory to God, amen. While others are recited silently, amen, or like some of us, amen, because we, don't, we can't carry a tune in a bucket like pastor, amen. So we sing under the breath. Yeah. But with a spirit of reverence. Right. Can I get a witness? Yeah. Now during the Passover meal, Four cups of wine are poured. And with each cup, a part of the Hallel is recited. Uh -huh. Teach today, Pastor. Right. The Hallel begins, amen, with Psalms 113, verses 1 and 2. And it says, praise ye the Lord. Right. Praise ye, O ye servants yeah. of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Blessed be the name of the Lord from this time forth That's right. That's right. and uh, forevermore. This was the opening hymn of the Passover celebration. In the late 1800s, Reverend Alexander B. Grossart, he wrote in his address, amen, to the Synod of the Presbyterian Church of England, that Jesus and his disciples, amen, would have sung the closing hymn of the halal, amen, yeah. Psalm 118, as they partook of the fourth Passover cup, mm -hmm. which was the cup of salvation. Yeah. He said that they would have left the upper room singing it as they headed for the Mount of Olives, right. the place of pressing. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. Yeah. Glory to God, amen. One particular verse of that final Hallel hymn says, The Lord is my strength and song and is become my salvation. These were the sacred hymns that filled Christ's overladen heart, amen, and broke into music on his trembling lips. The same quivering lips, amen, that will soon cry the words of Matthew 27 and 46. My God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? Y'all gonna pray with me today. But Christ would not cry these words, amen, before also uttering the words found in Luke 23 and 34 that have changed the course of mankind forever. Right. Well, what did he say in Luke 23 and 34? Mm. Father, uh -uh. Right now. forgive them. Yeah. I got some thems in here right now. Yeah. Father, yeah. forgive them. Yeah. I got some folks who don't know why they do what they do. Are you with me today? Am I the only one in here that sometimes, amen, when I would do right because evil is always present, amen, I find myself doing, amen, that that I would not do. So Jesus was praying for me when he said, Father, forgive them, for they know not why they lie on me. And I ain't done nothing to them. Father, forgive them, amen. For when they talk about me behind my back, when, when, when they get on the new telephone, amen, and, and they ought to be talking about gospel, amen, they're gossiping. Father, forgive them, for they know not what they do. Mm. You see, the Jews and the Romans didn't know what they were doing. Uh, all right. But God knew exactly what he was doing. Hallelujah. 
I wish I had a witness in here. He was sacrificing, amen, his only begotten son for the sins of mankind. On this Resurrection Sunday, amen, I submit to you, it's good to know that as believers, we are keeping alive the last hymn sung by Jesus and his disciples. And you know more of this hymn than you realize. It begins and ends with, Oh, give thanks unto the Lord, for he is good, because his mercy endureth forever. That's 118 verses 1 and 29. Some of you may know, amen, it's better to trust in the Lord than to put your confidence in man. Hello, somebody. 118 and verse 8. Yeah. Others may know the Lord is my strength and song. It has become my salvation. 118 verse 14. I hope y'all get some of this. Amen. And most all of you know the stone with the builders refused has become the head of the cornerstone. 118 Verse 22. If you didn't know some of these by heart, uh -huh. amen, at least you've heard them. Yes, sir. Am I right? Yes, sir. But I want to focus on just one line of this beautiful hymn. One line that is familiar to all of us. As Sister Ruth Walker might say, we all know it by heart. It's verse 24. Uh -huh. This is the day yeah. which the Lord hath made. Yes, Come on. We will rejoice yeah. and be glad yeah. in it. Yes, sir. You miss your shout right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is well, the day yeah. which the Lord have made. Yeah. We will yeah. rejoice yeah. and be glad yeah. in it. Yeah. Let me see if I can break it down for you. This is the day God created. The day set aside to celebrate the gift of God's only begotten son. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The one who died uh -huh. for you and I. Don't, don't, don't worry, don't worry about that. Amen, amen. I'm going to leave him dead for a little while, but I'm, I'm going to get him up. Yeah, yeah. A a amen, Glory. Right and I believe it deserves more than just an amen. All right. I believe it deserves a shout of praise. Yeah. I believe when we recognize that today, is the day that God has made, amen, that we celebrate the resurrection of Jesus, amen. I believe it deserves, amen, a hallelujah praise. I know it's Easter, Easter. Well. or resurrection day, for yeah. Otis. Uh -huh. And many gathered here have family plans after church. Uh -huh. Huh? But while I got you, let's take a few minutes, amen, and reflect on this one verse of the Hallel, amen. Why? I'm glad you asked. Because this is the day. Yes, sir. This. When Jesus and his disciples, amen, sang this is the day, the disciples were thinking this day was just another Passover day. But I submit to you, not Jesus. Hello, somebody. Jesus knew this is the day. Was a prophecy of what would soon come to pass. Huh? Jesus knew that this is a day that would turn the world upside down. Or should I say, right side up, right. Brother Larry. Watch. 
Let me paint the situation for you. Come on, Mankind uh -huh. was dead in sin. Paint the picture, paint the picture. Separated uh -huh. from God. Yeah. Living a lost life lost. in a lost world. Yeah. Even God's own chosen people yes, sir. Yeah. were unable to escape the appeal of sin. Yeah. It's not fooling yourself. Amen. Sin has a strong attraction. Can I get a witness? Amen. Anybody ever watch Star Trek? Amen. And, the, and Star Trek, amen. The Enterprise has what is called a tractor beam. Amen. And when it locks on something, amen, it pulls. And it won't let go. That's the way sin is sometimes, amen. It, it has a track to be, amen. And, and no matter how strong you think you are, amen, it will pull. Get a hold on. Get a hold on. Get a hold on. Hello, somebody. It pulled David. Hello, somebody. Standing on his own castle top. Hello, somebody. Yeah. When he should have been out there uh -huh. fighting with the rest of the soldiers. Yeah. But it was a tractor beam, amen, that locked in on Bathsheba, amen, and it pulled David yeah. to the point where he said, I gotta have her yeah. for myself. Yeah. Bless his holy name. Yeah. Even God's own chosen people yeah. were unable to escape the appeal of sin. Well, God chose this verse of the Hallel to declare his intent, amen, amen. to the right or to right the wrong yeah. that began with Adam and Eve in the Garden of Eden. Uh -huh. God chose to declare, as Paul wrote in Ephesians, chapter 1 and verse 10 and 12, that in the dispensation uh -huh. of the fullness of times, yeah. he might gather together in one all, amen, yeah. things in Christ, yeah. that we should on this day, uh -huh, on this day. can y'all say that with me, on this day, on this day. Be, be to the praise of his glory. Yeah who first trusted in Christ. You see, Antioch, for Jesus, the fullness of time was just a few hours away. Yeah, amen. Can I get a witness? Hello? And for you, the fullness of time was when, amen, you gave your heart and your soul to a man named Christ. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Stop by to tell you, you didn't choose to be here today in this sanctuary. I, I know you think you did, amen. Come on, come on. Dressed in all your finery. Because you wanted to be a part of the fashion show. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, glory to God. And I'm glad, amen. Things have changed from what they used to be, JC. When we would get dressed up from our toe to our head. And we would sashay in, amen. To the house of God, yeah. knowing, amen, to the Campbell, that we were fashionably late, yeah. but we wanted to be seen, amen, by all the saints, amen. So some of us, amen, would put a little extra sway yeah. to it. And when we sat down, amen, uh, we make sure that our hat was cocked. Yeah. So that the lilies of the valley uh -huh. could be seen by everybody. But I start by to tell you, amen, God chose for you to be here right now to praise him for the sacrifice of his son for your salvation. This is today. And since this is today, that the Lord made yes, to deliver us yeah. from sin. Yeah. 
then I submit to you, it's time to rejoice. This day is a day of celebration. It's a day for cheers, joy, and uh, jubilation. For those of us, amen, who know mm, that Jesus, who was buried in a borrowed tomb, For those of us who know, amen, uh, that he laid there Uh all night Friday. Uh That he laid there Uh all day Saturday. Am I right about it? That he laid there all night Saturday. Uh But if somebody said, I ain't ready yet. (laughs) I said, somebody said. Somebody said early Sunday morning he got up. I submit to you. This is a day for our hearts to leap in our chest as we consider, amen, uh, Jesus' great sacrifices just for us at the close of the Passover supper. It was custom for the Jews to go to the Mount of Olives. Bless his holy name. The Mount of Olives, amen, is a mountain ridge east of Jerusalem. And uh, it was and still is named for the olive groves that cover its slopes. It has also been a Jewish cemetery, yeah. right. amen, for the last 3,000 years, yes, holding over, watch this now, 150,000 graves yes, of glory to God, of some of the most prominent citizens yeah. and biblical kings yes, of Bible times. Right. Mount Olive was higher in elevation Amen. Then the Temple Mount. So it gave them a great vantage point to close out the Hallel. Amen. With a temple in full view. I wish y'all could see this. The Passover celebrants Mm -hmm. felt drawn to the grave of their ancestors on on that day to whisper their expectation of God's promise yeah, of a Messiah. Yes, uh-huh. Ain't God good? Yeah. Most of them didn't know that their Messiah uh-huh. was already among them. Uh-huh. Can I get a witness? Uh-huh. Some didn't know that they were standing right next to him. Uh-huh. Can I get a witness? Yeah. And yet Judas chose to abandon him. Antioch, I submit to you, if they had known Jesus was their promised deliverer, instead Uh of whispering the promise of God, I believe, amen, uh, they would have been expressing their overwhelming joy. Can I get a witness? It's not surprising, amen, uh, that God prophesied mankind's reaction Uh to the gift of his son. He said, amen, uh, we will uh, rejoice. And the word rejoice, Uh Western, it Uh comes, amen, uh, from the word ghoul, amen, uh, which means uh, to spin around. Uh Can I get a witness? And be under the influence of a violent emotion. Yes, it is a reactive emotion well, over which, amen, uh, you have uh, no conscience of control. Yes, and maybe, amen, uh, that's why somebody wrote the hymn, uh, What is this yeah. 
that's got me feeling so good right now. What is this that makes me want to run on uh, anyhow, uh, whatever it is, it just won't uh, let me uh, hold. Y'all heard it, amen. My peace. It's a reactive emotion, amen, uh, which you have uh, little control over. Amen. Uh, let me give you a couple of examples. Amen. Um, you open a letter which says, uh, I can talk to JC, amen. It says, amen, uh, your child, amen, uh, has received uh, a full scholarship to the college of his choice. Not your choice, but his choice. And you scream. Y'all don't know what I'm talking about. Y'all ain't got no children. Can I get it with an amen? Yeah, yeah, you, 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 you don't have any children, amen, to where you have to go over the mountain, amen, and get down on your knees and scrub other folks' flows. Go into the bathroom, uh, open up the toilet, and wash. Ain't no tiny bowl. Yeah. All you got, amen, uh, is your hand and a rag, and you got to clean, amen, uh, out somebody else's toilet in order, amen, uh, to get your child uh, some books. Can I get a witness, amen, uh, or maybe, amen, uh, just to get your child uh, a meal ticket, amen, who going off to college. But on this day, you open a letter. Watch it now. And it says, little Shanene has received a full scholarship to the college of her choice. And I don't know about you, but I scream yeah. my head off yeah. as I dance around yeah. the dining room table. Yeah. Can I get a witness? Yeah. I stop by to tell you my hands are going up and I'm giving God the praise yeah. and I'm saying two words, yeah. but God. Yeah. I stop by to tell somebody uh, that's rejoicing. Yeah. Am I right about it? Well, for those of you who are in this year 2024, and you're running a little short of uh, your ends to make things meet, but you scratch the last box on uh, your lottery ticket. Give me a nickel. Somebody give me a, give, give, let me borrow your lucky coin. I'll give it back to you in a minute. You scratch the last box on your lottery ticket. And it says, you matched and you won a million dollars. What do you do? You scream, you tremble, and uh, you run. Can I get a witness? You get happy in your feet. Because uh, you can't help yourself. Ain't that rejoicing? Can I get a witness? And you rejoice even more, amen, uh, when, amen, uh, you ain't got to share it with nobody but Jesus. Uh, Jews today are still whispering that line of the Hallel. All right. Amen. We will rejoice. Amen. 
they still see it as a future prophecy. They're whispering because they've yet to repent. I'm talking about Jews, y'all. And accept Jesus as their Messiah. But that's not the reaction Christian ought to have. We should be experiencing a violent or strong emotion yes, that causes us to move. Yeah. Can I get a witness? It causes us to move our hands. It causes us to move our feet. Yeah. It causes us to move our mouths yeah. and uh, our hearts. Yeah. Can I get a witness? Amen. Uh, and we move these items, amen, uh, toward a closer relationship uh, with Jesus. Yeah. I heard the old choir saying, amen, uh, just a closer walk with thee. Uh, granted, Jesus, if you please, uh, daily walking uh, close to thee, uh, let it be. Uh, Oh, Lord, let it be. Let it be. Mm. The good news that Christ rose, uh -huh. it should cause all of us uh -huh. who know that he lives yeah. to run yeah. and leap yeah. and shout for joy. Yeah. Can I get a witness? Yeah. Oh, bless his holy name. Yeah. How about it? Yeah. Are you rejoicing yeah. right now. Yeah. Some of you looking yeah. at me, yeah. amen, uh, like God yeah. ain't did nothing for you. Yeah. Some of you looking at me, uh, yeah. great God Almighty, uh, yeah. like you've been sucking on a sour lemon uh, all last night. Uh, or maybe, amen, uh, you had a persimmon, amen, uh, for breakfast uh, this morning. Uh, but I stopped by, amen, uh, yeah. to tell somebody, uh, great God Almighty, uh, your soul uh, uh -huh. ought to be rejoicing uh, yeah. in the God uh, of your salvation. Uh, yeah. But I'm wondering today, amen, uh, are you sitting uh, on uh, your salvation? Will you give uh, God the glory and the honor, amen, um, he deserves uh, for so great a gift. If you know what I'm saying, amen, uh, you ought to shout, amen, uh, hallelujah, glory to God. Uh, in other words, uh, somebody, amen, uh, ought to have uh, an anyhow, uh, hallelujah, in the house, amen. Uh, Hallelujah, amen, uh, anyhow, uh, because, amen, uh, he'll be bread uh, when I'm hungry. Hallelujah, anyhow, amen, uh, he'll be water when I'm thirsty. Uh, hallelujah, anyhow, amen, uh, he's a doctor in my sick room. Uh, he's a lawyer in my courtroom. Uh, can I get a witness? Uh, hallelujah. If you know, amen, uh, he's a friend uh, when you need a friend. Uh, I heard, I heard him say, uh, greater love uh, had no man uh, than to lay down uh, his life uh, for his friend. Uh, God's prophecy. In the Hallel, uh -huh. not only says we will rejoice, uh -huh. but it also says we will, we will. be glad uh -huh. in it. Uh -huh. Y'all gonna help me bring this home. Uh -huh. If rejoicing uh -huh. is reactive, uh -huh. then I submit to you yeah. being glad. Yeah is proactive. Pro that will of somebody here. Yeah. When well. you rejoice, yeah. you can't help yeah. yourself. Yeah. Anybody ever had a case yeah. of the I-J? 
just can't help it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. But when you're glad, uh -huh. you're making a deliberate attempt to spread your joy. Yes, Rejoicing should always be followed by gladness. Yes, or it was never rejoicing in the first place. The psalmist says, the psalmist says, rejoice and uh, be glad. Can I get a witness? The word glad means make merry. Gladness, Vicky. It comes, amen, uh, from a desire, amen, uh, to share something, amen, uh, that you are inwardly, amen, uh, and helplessly right. excited about. If your heart yeah. is rejoicing uh -huh. in the God yes. of your salvation, yes. right, right. I stop by to tell somebody, you ought to make merry. Yeah. Hello, somebody. Uh -huh. You ought to make merry mm, to share the good news Hallelujah. with those around you. Yeah. Amen. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And Antioch, that's being uh, proactive. Right. Right. Am I right about it? Yes, sir. And it's the only way uh, souls get saved. Yes, sir. Yes. Hello, somebody. Uh, oh. Souls are not saved uh, yeah. when you sit down, amen, uh, on the fact that God has been good uh, to you, uh, right. can I get a witness? Yeah. I stopped by to tell somebody, yeah. amen, uh, he's been good yeah. to me, amen, yeah. uh, and I just can't uh, hold uh, my peace, uh, yeah. can I get a witness? Yeah. I get glad, yeah. amen, uh, when I think about uh, the goodness uh, of God uh, and all uh, he's done uh, yeah. just to me. Uh, yeah. I get clapping in my hands, uh, I get running uh, in my feet, uh, can I get a witness, I get a song, amen, uh, in my heart, amen, uh, and I've got to tell somebody, amen, uh, the God I serve uh, is good uh, to me, amen, uh, I stop by to tell somebody, amen, uh, the word of God says, uh, be glad, uh, am I right about it? Rejoice, rejoice, uh, and be glad uh, in it. Uh, gladness is contagious, amen, uh, and gladness uh, is transmissible, amen. Uh, gladness is infectious, and gladness, amen, uh, is, amen, uh, a communicable uh, emotion, uh, metaphorically, amen, uh, it spreads uh, like a virus, amen, uh, and I'm wondering today, uh, is there anybody here, amen, uh, that's glad today, uh, are you glad, amen, uh, great God Almighty, uh, that the word of God, uh, it says, amen, uh, God so loved the world uh, that he gave uh, his only begotten son. Uh, can I get a witness, amen, uh, that whosoever, amen, uh, believeth in him uh, might not perish, uh, but have uh, everlasting life. Uh, I'm going to get glad, y'all, amen. Uh, the word says uh, he sent his son uh, into the world, uh, not, amen, uh, to condemn the world, uh, but that the world, amen, uh, through him uh, it might be saved. Uh, I don't know about you, uh, but I'm glad, amen. Uh, Jesus, amen, uh, of Nazareth, amen, uh, was born uh, of a virgin uh, named Mary, amen. Uh, I'm glad, amen, uh, that Joseph, amen, uh, that carpenter uh, adopted him uh, as his son. Uh, I'm glad, amen, uh, they raised him uh, and he grew uh, in spirit uh, and in wisdom. Uh, I'm glad today, amen, uh, that at the age of 12, amen, and, uh, he separated himself uh, from his family, amen, uh, and was found, amen, uh, in the temple, amen, uh, 
being about uh, his father's business. Uh, am I right about it? Uh, I know I'm right about it. Uh, I'm glad, amen, uh, that 18 more years uh, would pass, amen. Uh, and I got glad, amen, uh, at the wedding feast uh, in Canaan, amen, uh, when they ran out of wine. Uh, and there was, amen, uh, somebody there who would turn water in the wine. Uh, Y'all don't hear me, amen. I'm glad, amen. Not only did he turn water in the wine, but he fed a multitude of people with a few little fish and some barley loaves. I'm getting glad, y'all, amen. I'm glad, amen. Great God Almighty, that he come the raging sea just by saying, peace be still. It marveled those on the ship with him. Him, uh, and they said, uh, what manner of man is this? Uh, the winds uh, and the waves uh, obey his will. Uh, I'm glad, amen, uh, great God Almighty. Uh, I'm getting glad, y'all, amen, uh, that that same Jesus uh, stopped the funeral procession uh, coming out of a city called Nain. Uh, I'm glad, amen, uh, he delayed, amen, uh, when he got word uh, that his best friend, uh, Lazarus, was sick. Uh, great God Almighty, uh, my Bible says uh, they got happy, amen, uh, but they got glad uh, when Jesus showed up uh, and said, amen, uh, show me where you laid him, uh, great God Almighty, uh, I heard, I heard uh, Mary and Martha say, uh, it doesn't matter, great God Almighty, uh, he's stinking now, uh, but Jesus said, uh, you don't know uh, who I am, uh, I am, uh, the resurrection uh, and the life uh, he that believeth in me uh, though he were dead uh, yet shall uh, he live again uh, and whosoever believeth in me uh, shall never die I'm glad amen uh, I believe in him uh, I might close my eyes one day uh, but I will not die I'm getting happy y'all uh, I got happy amen uh, when he left the upper room uh, after singing uh, the Hallel song, amen, uh, and he went to the garden uh, of Gethsemane, amen, uh, where he would be pressed, uh, he would be pressed, amen, uh, in prayer, amen, uh, to blood uh, or sweat like blood uh, ran down his face. Uh, I'm getting happy, y'all. Uh, I got happy, amen, uh, when Judas came uh, and betrayed him uh, with a kiss, y'all. Uh, I got happy, amen, uh, as they marched him uh, from judgment hall uh, to judgment hall uh, and whipped him uh, all night long. Uh, great God Almighty, uh, I got happy, y'all, uh, when they placed the crown of thorns uh, on his head uh, and they put a nasty robe uh, around his shoulder. He said uh, he's the king of the Jews. Uh, I got happy, y'all, uh, when they placed that bar on his shoulder uh, and he marched, amen, uh, up the hill uh, called Via Dolorosca to the place of the school uh, called Calvary. I got happy, y'all, uh, when they hung him uh, with the nails uh, on that other beam uh, and lifted him. Uh, why did I get happy? Uh, he said, uh, he said, if I be lifted up uh, from the earth, uh, I'll draw. I'll draw. I'll draw all men unto me. Uh, they lifted up uh, my Savior, placed him uh, between uh, two thieves. Uh, he died. He died from the sixth to the ninth hour. My Bible says there was blackness all over the earth as Jesus, the Son of God, began to shine. The S-U-N uh, hid his face. Uh, am I right about it? Uh, the record says uh, as he began uh, to fulfill uh, the will of God, uh, he laid his head uh, in the locks of his shoulder and he said, uh, Father, 
and to thy hands uh, I commend uh, my spirit. Uh, my Bible says uh, I'm getting happy, y'all. Uh, he gave up the ghost. Uh, he died. Uh, great God Almighty. Uh, they took his body uh, down from uh, that old rugged cross. Uh, placed it uh, in a tomb. Uh, am I right about it? Uh, in my vernacular, they placed a rock uh, in a rock. Uh, put a rock uh, on the outside of a rock. Uh, seal the rock uh, with another rock. But early Sunday morning, uh, the rock on the outside uh, gave up, amen. Uh, the rock covering the hole, uh, and the rock on the inside uh, came out. Uh, do you know him? Uh, have you tried him? Uh, does he live? Uh, he lives. Him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That change the world forever. Yeah. Great is the Lord. Yeah. And he's greatly to be praised. Yeah. This is the day yeah. that the Lord yeah. had made. Yeah. Clap your hands yeah. if you believe yeah. that this is the day that the Lord has made us uh, jump up, get on your feet, uh, and shout amen. Uh, this is the day uh, that the Lord has made us. Uh, I will, I will, I will rejoice because Jesus lives. together. Look at your name and tell them, this is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made, that the Lord, I will, heaven laden and I will give you rest. This is the day that he made just for you. It doesn't matter what you've done and how long you've done it. If you will come 
come today and give your life to him. He will give you a new start. For his word, his word still says, if anyone be in Christ, you're a new creature. Don't get it twisted. Don't get it twisted. You're going to still have the same hands, but they just won't be doing the same thing. You still have the same feet, but they just won't have a desire to go in the same old places. You still have that same mouth, but the Holy Spirit will give you a bridle for your tongue. Will you come today? This is your day. This resurrection. Sunday morning. Let the spirit of the living God yes. rise and live in you. Yes. Today, today, today. Uh, Confess with your mouth. It's just yes. that easy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. A belief in your heart that Jesus yes. is the Christ. Yes. The son of the living God. That he suffered, bled, and died for your sins. But that he rose early Sunday morning for your redemption. And the Bible says, thou shalt be saved. Understand this, folk. Time is running out and winding up. Somebody that woke up this morning will not wake up tomorrow. And it could be you. Only you know what your relationship with God is really. We need to stop putting on this facade. Acting like church folk. And knowing that we are not saved. Clapping hands that we know that are not holy. Moving feet, amen, that we know that are not righteous. The Bible still says, and I believe every word of it, it is appointed unto all of us once to die. We are living to die. Even the youngest of us was born in this world to die. Yes, yes. Stop thinking, amen, that after you die, you got time even then to get it. No, no, after you die, there is instant judgment. Yes, sir. And based on how you have lived in this world, yes. the righteous judge will either say unto you, Come ye blessed of my father. And into the master, or he'll say, Depart from me. I know you not. The choice is yours. Will you come? This can be the best day to rededicate your life. If you've been baptized and, come on y'all, amen, but you strayed away for whatever reason, come on back today. Just say, I'm rededicated. I'm recommitted. I'm realigning. Will you come?
able. just really starting to live. Yeah. But she's come to the crossroad to where at 16 she understands that she needs Jesus yeah. in her life. Amen. 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 She's a beautiful, young, yeah. intelligent looking, lovely yeah. female. Amen. 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 And I want you to know that there's some knuckleheads out there, amen, that's going to now start looking at you a whole lot differently, amen. But you're going to get covered, amen, next Sunday, amen. Glory to God. She's coming as a candidate for baptism. Let me ask you something. Do you believe with all your heart that Jesus of Nazareth, Mary's baby, who was born in Bethlehem, laid in that manger. Do you believe that same Jesus who hung, bled, and died on Calvary is the one and the same? Hallelujah. And you're willing at 16, knowing that you got a whole lot more life left to live, understanding that the road going to get rough, okay? The going is going to get tough. Amen. Just because you're giving your life to Christ, amen, it ain't going to be all howdy, howdy, and never a rainy day. But you're willing today to tell these folk that you've made Jesus your choice. And you're willing to be baptized with water and the Spirit. Come out, amen, shouting hallelujah. Not just dripping wet. <laughs> Amen. Amen. You've heard her testimony. She's coming as a candidate for baptism. Amen. To join the body of Christ through the Antioch Missionary Baptist Church. What say you? Javeria. Javeria. That's a big old M, right? Okay. I got it now. I don't know what I thought. Amen. 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 It's been motion and probably second, amen, that we receive Sister Brim Shamiria, amen, as a candidate for, for baptism to be baptized on next Sunday, amen. Woo! And after baptism, amen, she received the right hand of fellowship and all rights and privileges of any other member of the Anna Bishop Baptist Church. Are you ready for the question? Yes, all those in favor, let it be known by saying I. I, I. Watch this now. Oppose this. Amen. Amen. Let me be the first to embrace you into the body of Christ. Amen. Praise God.
I know you're anxious to get outside and hunt for the treasures in those colored little or spherical things. Amen. But I have yet just a little more for us to do. God has blessed us. Amen. With new life. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Amen. Well. And on this day, we want to rededicate and christen these little ones, rededicate them back to God and christen them as his little angels yes. in whom we will, amen, have guardianship <laughs> and stewardship over. Amen. Will the parents of Zola Ray Williams, amen, bring Zola along with you down to the front, to my left. Zola Ray Williams, born January the 18th of this year. Amen. Turner, pull that, just a pedestal, pull that back a little bit, just a pedestal, amen. Chris, Senator Amaya, move to my left a little bit, amen. Grandparents, if you will come. Amen. As they are coming, amen. On August the 30th of 2023, amen, God also blessed, amen, us with little Tasha Grace Henley, amen, with the parents, amen, of little Miss Tasha Grace Henley, bring her down. Grandma, granddaddy, great granddaddy, y'all, y'all, y'all move a little bit. I, I, I want y'all behind them. I want y'all, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, it's gonna take a village. Yeah. Hey, Amen. I want the village to be present. Y'all come on with Tasha. Grandparents, a -a amen. Come on, why, why, why are they acting good? And the rest of the families. Y'all come on, y'all, y'all holding these children up from their heads. It ain't me. <laughs> it's all good. This is important. 
for we're living in perilous times and our children need to be placed in the hands of God. Not only should our children be placed in the hands of God, but their parents and grandparents and godparents, aunts and uncles and anybody else. Jesus said, suffer the little children and forbid them not to come unto me for such is the kingdom of heaven. Today these parents, the Williams and the Henleys, have come acknowledging and professing their dependence on our Lord God to raise their children. Zola Ray Williams, and Pastor Grace Henley. Brother and Sister Williams, do you profess Jesus Christ as the, your Lord and Savior of your lives? I, I need to hear you. Praise God. And do you dedicate yourselves to biblical instruction Biblical discipline and divine love for this child, Zola Ray Williams, born January the 18th of 2024. Will you? Amen. Amen. Christian, I can't hear you. Oh, 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 okay, I, I need some bass down there. So. And do you come today? Mr. and Mrs. Williams, to dedicate Zola Ray Williams and to allow us to christen her and give her ultimate control to our Lord and Savior and the will of God through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. And to this entire family, do you pledge to the best of your ability to assist them in bringing up Zola Ray Williams into the knowledge and the maturity of God and to love him even as you love him. Family, what will you say? Yes. Amen. 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 Brother and sister Henley, do you today come acknowledging and professing your dependency on our Lord and Savior and our God to help raise and mature Tasha Grace Henley in this world in which we live. <sighs> Do you come professing that you love the Lord and that you're willing from this day forward to let the Lord our God, Christ Jesus, and the Holy Spirit rule and govern your life as you rule and govern her life and direct her in this world. Yes. Amen. Amen. Do you also come to dedicate yourselves and this child to biblical instruction, biblical discipline, and the divine love for this child as long as she and you live? Do you come also to dedicate and commit and allow this child, Tasha Grace Henley, to be given back to God's ultimate control All right. for the rest of her life? Yes. To this family behind you, are you also willing to assist them in the raising the nurturing, the maturing of this child to love God as you love God and to obey and follow his will to the best of your ability. Yes. Amen.
All heads bowed. Yes, Lord. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we now christen these children, these young ladies, these little girls, you, as children given unto us by you. Father, we pray your divine blessings of grace, mercy, love, and favor upon Zola Ray and Tasha Grace for the rest of their lives. That, Lord God, even as you have given them to us, we now give them back to you, O oh God. Wrap your loving arms of protection around them. Lead and guide them, O oh God, in every aspect of their lives. Father, enable them to understand that your plan for prosperity and longevity is to honor their mothers and their fathers. You promised that their days would be long upon this land. Now, Lord God, as we give them back to their parents and the families, we pray, oh God, that you will encourage them to be obedient to your word, to teach them your love, to teach them your will, to teach them your commandments, to teach them, oh God, to trust you in all their ways and acknowledge you in everything and you will direct their path. And we'll be careful to give you the glory, the honor, and the praise in the mighty name of Jesus. We now do this in Jesus' name. And the church says amen, 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 amen. amen. and amen. amen. You were good. And you were good too. Fathers, fathers, be good and present fathers Amen. in the lives of your children, especially your daughters. Give them an image of the man that you would like for them to meet later on in life. Don't just be a father in finance. Be present in every aspect of their lives. Okay? Provide not only finance, but provide heavenly food for them. Pray with them. Pray over them. And most of all, nurture the woman that brought these children into the world. Love your wife as Christ loved the church. Let me blow your mind. Christ died for the church. Be willing to give your life for the female, the woman who have given you these beautiful daughters. And I promise you, God will bless you even as he blessed so many others. Amen. Do this in the name of Jesus. Amen. And the church said amen. 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 Let's go home. Amen. Come on, put your hands together. The Jesus in me, love the Jesus in you. The Jesus in me, love the Jesus in you, so easy, so easy, so easy, so easy to love. Come on, Andy, I'll put the Jesus in me. Love the Jesus in you, the Jesus in me, love the Jesus in you. Bring me down, bring me down. I'm getting ready to give the benediction. Bro Williams, would, do you want to come with some instructions for the egg hunt? Okay.
We got some chill, some children still here. I'll do your prayer real quick. Yes. Amen. 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 Anything else, Brother Williams? Okay. Baptism next Sunday at 9 o'clock, right before Sunday school. Right. Our heads are bowed real quick. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we pray now that your spirit will govern and abide as our children now, oh God. Go out and have fun hunting for these eggs that the church, amen, has made available to them. Father, protect them, O oh God, from any evil elements that may spoil their fun. Let them rejoice and be glad over every aid that they find and the pride that will be therein. We love you. We magnify you in Jesus' name. We give you glory, honor, and praise. Amen. Amen. And now may the grace of God, the love of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, and the sweet communion of the Holy Spirit rest from the Bible with you all, henceforth, now and forever. The people of God say together, Amen. Amen. Amen.